What's up YouTube? Welcome to Chin and Chew Reviews. I'm Chin and this is my mum Chew. It's Chew here, we're doing a review. Boom! Hello! Uh, welcome. Today we have these Ajimoto brands. They actually are the people who make MSG and invented it. Well, the company that originally invented Was it the guy? It was a doctor actually, a Japanese yeah. doctor, but I mean they're the, ri they're the first ones to manufacture it. So these are, I believe, Peking duck flavour. Peking duck flavour? Yeah. Okay, and yes. I love Peking duck, so I wanted to try these. I saw them in a Chinese supermarket and thought I'd give them a go. Yes. Let's get on and try these then. First of all, I'm going to try it. is quite good. Without. Good. It's a little bit disappointing. Mm. I smell that. Liver. Mm. Yeah. Huh? To me, it tastes a bit like a pasty because it's a little carrots in. Yeah, it, has. it tastes a bit like a pasty. Mm. Doesn't it? I mean, there is duck flavour in there. I think the carrots spoil it. Yeah, the carrots do have yeah. spoiled it, but they've done it to pad it out. They should have pad it out with water chestnuts, it probably yeah. would have been cheaper. Yeah. Tastes better. Tastes way well. better. Yeah. Try it with some of this sauce. They've got light dark soy sauce, a touch of sesame oil, and about a teaspoon of Chinese rice wine vinegar. They work really nice in there, but yeah, as they stand, they're not brilliant, are they? No. I think they're really I poor. Taste, isn't it? I couldn't taste that duck. And it's meant to be aromatic duck. There's no aromatic flavour in there, is there? Mm. It, to me, it's just like they've blended duck up. I will say. Good. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of chestnut in there, tiny bit. Yeah. Mm. And you can taste the, the texture, isn't it? I'm going to put the colour in there. No. I mean, it's nicer than the ones we bought from Tesco's yeah. or Morrison's. Is that Goya or something like that, that one's called? Jiao Is it? No, uh, it's the Japanese name. Yeah. I can't remember, Goya or something Go like that? Gojo or something like that. We call them Jiao Zi anyway. Yeah, yeah it's uh, disappointing. I can't even be bothered to keep going with this. <laughs> I will just get it, because they've got loads of different ones with different stuffing. I, maybe it's just this. Also, the, the, the pastry's a bit oily. But that could have just been... Normally it's never that oily, but it's everywhere. It's not not edible, but it's edible, but there's not um, there's no, no flavour. Yeah, yeah, it's not bad, but it's really not good. The ins like I said, the insides needs more flavour. Yeah, you can, now and then you can taste a bit of um, <clears throat> a hint of that the not the 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 smell of the duck. Yeah, it tastes like. This tastes a bit like to me. It tastes more like pork than chicken or uh, duck. That's that I could taste like the the smell of the uh, roast song smell. The uh, can I say yeah pickle. <laughs> the sense of the duck. You know when when you get a duck, you get a ham at the back there. It's very strong with that smell. Yeah. Do you not know what not people is English? Huh? Do you not know what people is Us. English? Yeah. Yeah. You could say that. Okay. Yeah, I know exactly what you mean. Yeah. That's really all those, isn't yeah. it? What do you call it? Strong. Yeah. Pungent. Yeah. It's because oh, there are people who like the the taste of it. It's a delicacy. Yeah. Enough, and there are some people who just run away and throw it. <laughs> Like, I suppose it's like caviar, some people like fish and those people yeah. who don't like. Yeah, that's exactly what it is like. Yeah. So what's your verdict for this? Like, how many points are you going to give it? I wouldn't... It's not bad. No, I reckon... I wouldn't recommend anybody. I wouldn't recommend my my friend who go and buy it. Yeah, I wouldn't either. Oh. I think I'd give it... A three. I wouldn't say three, I'd give it four. Yeah. Three's quite low. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's, it's, I don't know the number, I thought three. <laughs> I say four out of ten. It's like someone out there, you might love these. Like we say, our what we like, you might not like, what you like, we might not like. Yeah, the only reason I can eat them, well, not I can eat them, I can eat them as they are, but 
What makes them taste nice is enhance the flavour. More of the put well, it just that yeah. takes the flavour of the inside away, so mm -hmm. I can't taste it, and it's just become texture. No one can taste the sesame and vinegar and the saltiness, and it's delicious. It's not enhancing the flavour of the jalza. No, no, not at all. So four out of ten for me, three out of ten for you. Yeah. So it's three and a half out of ten. Yes. For these. And what we'll do is try and get, I will try and get a different flavour, see if the different flavours are different because the actual, the pastry is quite nice. Yes. But it's the... The filling is a massive letdown. Yes. Maybe don't do, do duck in, it's very difficult to get the flavour right, isn't it? Especially if you're not deep frying it. Yeah. Because you've got to prep duck really well. Yeah. And then if you put it in the water and then go away, oh my God. Yeah. It's a bit like a uh, wet dog smell, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, that's exactly what it's like. So yeah. there we go. Thank yeah. you very much for watching, guys. Mum? Don't forget to hit the like button. And thank you for watching. See you next time. Cheers. Happy, oh. ha not happy, copying. Happy cooking, happy eating. There you go, cheers. <laughs>